Street Fighter 2 fucking V gotta burn some muscle. That's the tagline to the 1995 release 29 episode anime series directed by Suji Gasabro and written by Amai Kanichi. This anime series released in 1995 is an alternate storyline to the tale of Ryu and Ken or Ken and Ryu back when the two were young and 17 years old and Ryu had spiky hair quite akin to Kazuya, Mishima Kazuya from the Tekken series and Ken Masters obviously has long hair, long blonde hair and their personalities are so distinct and fit them so well to a fucking T or rather to a fucking muscle and trust me guys and gals despite these two being kids in essence their bodies are built like fucking tanks and this anime series has so much of that romance shit you would think these two are gay but they are best friends best friends for life Ryu and Ken are two young boys who train together and grew to respect each other in whichever timeline in the Street Fighter mythology or mythos but in this alternate tale which is my personal favorite of any of them Ken and Ryu or Ryu and Ken are just kids who want to have fun kick ass and of course train in martial arts and believe me guys and gals both Ryu and Ken get a lot more than that in this 29 episode anime series one of my all-time favorites Street Fighter 2v gotta burn some muscle a lot of muscle to be burned and not so much built because that's exactly how machismo this anime series is driven with so much machismo and so much manliness and bromance it would give a grown-ass man a muscle-bound grown ass man three balls or four or more that's how awesome it is and so cringe worthy it is in a good way it's good cringe especially when you watch it in the English dub I really if ever watch any anime series in the English dub because the Japanese is my personal favorite and has been made to be spoken in Japanese the anime series that is of any manga or video game adapted anime series or rather any anime series which is an original tale not based on a video game or manga but in the case with Street Fighter 2v it's based on the video game fighting franchise by Capcom Capcom Studios who yours truly loves so much and Street Fighter 2v gotta burn some muscle like yours truly said tells the tale of Ryu and Ken or Ken and Ryu two young martial artists who wish to learn to be strong and new techniques in martial arts which is exactly what they do and they meet so many other new people people who would become their allies and friends as well as family because family is what they are among them being Chun Li and her father Dorai chief inspector or chief detective or whatever Dorai and Guile fucking Guile is in this series and it's so great to see him it is guys and gals fucking Guile is the man don't see him the Indian monk is also in this series and he is so wise and so pacifistic a pacifist who hates violence and any such acts of violence and we also have Kami the best version of Kami in any of the Street Fighter games or anime series because Kami in this series is a lot more complex and a Christian but also an assassin Kami is not wearing that shitty outfit of hers the skimpy one which you truly hates so much but is wearing an actual combat outfit in this series an assassin's outfit and it's so fucking awesome and so badass just like Kami is and once again Kami is a lot more complex and someone who is battling her duty as an assassin and her belief as a Christian which is so awesome to see the complexity and humanity of any characters present on screen big screen or small screen screen it's so good to see and we also have very long Watch out! Man, guys and gals, I love Fei Long, and the fact that Fei Long, like many other characters like him, is so inspired by Bruce Lee in his design and his fighting style. Watch out! 
I love that shit so much, guys and gals. His war cry, when he fights, he is so much like Bruce Lee. It's so uncanny, but so great too. And we also have fucking Vega. Vega, or Balrog, as he is known as in the Japanese version of Street Fighter. Vega, in this series in particular, we see his psychotic nature unfold, but we also see that Vega does have respect for a real man, a true opponent, who's worthy of his respect and him calling them brother which is exactly what he calls Ken Master when these two fought each other in what is the best fight of the entire series in my honest opinion it was so good so bloody and so awesome it was it was so great to see these two battle and fight one another and their personalities are so distinct and are portrayed so well on screen thanks to the Japanese actors who deliver so well in their respective roles they do guys and gals and finally we have Vega or M. Bison as he is known in the Japanese version of Street Fighter gotta burn some fucking muscles M. Bison is the main baddie of this series as he is in the Street Fighter franchise aside from Akuma Akuma who's so awesome and so great but M. Bison or Vega is so iconic he always has been M. Bison in this series I love his laugh and the fact that M. Bison is so bad and so sinister yet so awesome still and the English actor as well as the Japanese actor had so much fun playing him M. Bison or Vega he is so great and so awesome oh my god guys and gals I almost forgot fucking Sagat Sagat guys and gals I love this motherfucker so much Sagat has both eyes not one eye he is Sagat has two eyes and no scar on on his chest since this storyline is so alternate to the storyline of Street Fighter the original game and tale Sagat and Ryu do fight each other but it's so different the circumstance in which they fight each other but it's so awesome still and the fact that these two become best friends and rivals proper rivals who don't hate each other but respect one another as they do later on in the Street Fighter series but I do prefer this version of their tale, their bond and rivalry. I do guys and gals. I forgot to mention this guys and gals, but the soundtrack to Street Fighter 2 V was so fucking good, especially the Hadouken theme which is also titled The Victory Theme. This theme right here basically sums up the bond between Ryu and Ken. Hado Shiryu. You see guys and gals? Hado Shiryu and Hado Ken. And you guys and gals can listen to the song for yourselves but this theme right here is so great and so fucking awesome and sums their bond up so well in ways that words cannot but now guys and gals bear witness to this song or theme Hadouken!
Fighter 2V got to burn some muscle is so great and so awesome and the fighting it's so hard hitting and so damn great to see guys and gals the hard punches and kicks it's so fucking great and so fucking awesome to witness as a fan of the Street Fighter series and a fan of martial arts films it's so great guys and gals I fucking love that shit guys and gals I love it so much this series this 29 episode anime series I do recommend you guys and gals watch it please do this anime series has so much action heart and soul the comedy in this series is so great and reminds you how much Ken and Ryu are still kids kids who are muscle bound strong and help others thank you all for watching hope you enjoyed the video and if you did please like comment subscribe if you wish and do check out my gaming channel where I do let's play series gaming content and so much more until next time peace out take care adios amigos au revoir and sayonara